Micronesia is one of three subregions of Oceania. The name Micronesia means small islands. With a total landmass of only 2,000 square miles, these islands are indeed dots in the beautiful blue ocean around them. Kosrai is one of the four main islands in the Federated States of Micronesia. In this island, you will see beautiful sunsets, lush green forests, exotic fruit trees, and a lot of friendly people who know how to live in community. There are large churches in Kosrai. The majority of the people attend the large church buildings of this main denomination here. In Kosrai, the families are very close and stick together wherever they go. So when a person decides to join a different church group, that means severing from family, friends, and any inheritance the family might leave you. Conversion is such a strong decision that one may come from riches to living on the streets on the same day. While coming to an Adventist church may be considered social suicide, attending an Adventist school is highly valued here. In fact, the Seventh-day Adventist school in Kosrai, as well as other Adventist schools in Micronesian islands, have graduated senators, queens, and other government officials. Our schools are well known uh, throughout the community, and many of the leaders in the islands have gone through our schools. For example, in Palau, the Queen of Palau went to our schools. Uh, several of the senators have gone to our school. Right here in Guam, the former lieutenant governor, had gone through our school to Walla Walla and then to uh, Loma Linda Medical Center where he became a doctor and he practices here. So we have a lot of the leadership in the, in the islands. In uh, Pompeii, for example, the former lieutenant governor who's now a pastor for us. This legacy of quality and holistic education at large is credited to the dedicated work of student and volunteer missionaries who come from all over North America and the world. They come for one year to teach, serve, love, and care for the precious children in the islands. This is a lifetime opportunity to engage a different culture and to share the love of Christ. The youth here in Kosrai love to play sports. They often spend their time practicing and playing with the neighbors at the local ball field and on the school court. Unfortunately, the weather is so unpredictable here, when it rains, it pours. Also, the sun near the equator burns hotter during the day, and at night, there is scarce access to electric light. The kids get together and play anyway. The Adventist Church wants to build a gym here in Kosrai, as well as on three other schools in the islands that do not yet have a gym. Gymnasiums have proven to be an effective tool to invite the community to play sports and have fun, but also as a place to conduct common interest seminars, a place for shelter, and many other relationship building activities. In Kosrai, this gym will become the center of attraction to the people of the island. Can you imagine the impact this will make? This quarter, your offering will go to support the construction of four gyms in the islands of Kosrai, Chuk, Yap, and Saipan. This small investment will pay dividends now and for eternity. Please pray for the children attending Adventist schools in Micronesian islands. Also pray for the community around Camp Polaris in Alaska. A portion of your 13th Sabbath offering this quarter will support these projects and other outreach initiatives in North America.